dark. Okay. Uh, is, are we counting down there? No. Technical difficulties. We are. It says live. Okay, it's working. All right. All right. Sorry, folks. We have a little technical difficulties here, but I think we got it under control now. I'm Dr. Jim Hogue, and uh, we're going to share something really amazing with you today. Uh, if you have questions, feel free to make a comment. Also, if you like this, please let me know. Hit the like button and uh, make sure you, you like our Facebook page. Also, if you have a personal question that you don't want to post publicly, feel free to um, message me on the Facebook Messenger. Now, I've been in practice for about 34 years using some amazing techniques uh, that are pretty unique to this area. Uh, only a few people are using these, and they're all people that have been my students in the past. Um, we use applied kinesiology. We use neuroemotional technique. We use um, quantum neurology, and we use uh, cold laser therapy. Because of this, we're able to help thousands of people in the last, last three decades to achieve a healthier, more abundant, health, happier life. We have people coming from all over, been other doctors, and, uh, and those people that have not gotten help other places often get help here because of the approach that we use. Now, in addition to using these tremendous techniques, one thing we like to do in our office is to teach people how to help themselves. We do lifestyle counseling, and we teach incredibly powerful techniques you can use at home to improve your health and your life and your mood, which is what we're going to talk about today. Today we're going to talk about a technique that can transform your mood in minutes, dramatically. Now, I think I talked about yesterday being a heck Jekyll Hyde or Hyde Jekyll transformation. It's amazing. Uh, have you ever had a situation where you found you were just really down? You uh, didn't feel like doing anything. Nothing was any fun. Life just kind of sucked. Maybe you're kind of cranky. Maybe you're depressed. Maybe you felt life was not worth living. That's happened sometimes. And what's characteristic of this is that maybe yesterday you didn't feel that bad. Maybe even an hour ago you didn't feel that bad. But all of a sudden now, you are just in the pit. Well, in that case, you may have a, a situation which we call pre post ganglionic involvement. It <clears throat> affects a lot of the chakras and acupuncture pathways in the body. And it can make you feel horrible. I would rather be in pain than have this, because when I'm in pain, I can still have fun, but when I've got pre post ganglionic involvement, nothing is any fun. Nothing's fun at all. And my wife, I just get kind of down with it, but my wife, does, she's the Jekyll Hyde transformation. Uh, she gets really, really angry about everything. And when this happens, we check her for pre-post, and we, within, within minutes, she's herself again. It's like, oh, there's my wife. I knew you were in there someplace. And as, hard, as bad as it is to be around somebody like that, it's worse, much worse, to be that person who's having that problem because everything is awful. Now, I'm not going to teach you the way to test for it because you don't really need to know that. And it gets a little tricky. You'd have to know how to do muscle testing and things. But what we're going to do is teach you um, how to fix it. And I like this technique because it's something you can fix without screwing it. Well, there's one way you can screw it up. Um, and I'm gonna, that's one way to do this video because I teach my, student, my, my patients to do this. But um, I had one patient in earlier this week and she said, I was afraid to do it because he said, if I did it wrong, it can make things worse. And that's true. It can make things worse if you do it wrong. That's it, the, the way to do it right is very simple, but if you do it wrong, it could be a problem. Now, what causes this seems to be weather changes, like we're having right now. Uh, storm fronts coming through, you have a change in the ion concentration before and after a storm, and that can do it, or also uh, really strong emotions, even good ones. You know, some people get married and they're just so happy, and then they're just really down, you know. And it's because they've kind of overloaded the nervous system. Too much, too much good could be a problem as well as too much uh, bad. Uh, so the things that do it are the weather changes, especially storm fronts coming through, and then the strong emotions. Uh, so if you notice that you or someone you care about is suddenly not doing too well, especially if they're kind of cranky, 
um, and they've just been a weather change or there's been you know some big emotional thing going on then they could have this problem and if they do then it'll make a dramatic change within minutes so here's what you do um, it's really simple it resets all these uh, all the uh, chakras and the acupuncture points most of the time so you just tap around your belly button clockwise i know it looks like a, this looks like really that's it it's really simple it's really simple which is great because it's not complicated everyone can do it you have to be careful though to do it clockwise don't do it counterclockwise because you can make it worse so clockwise like there's a clock in your stomach and you're following the hands around you want to go about four times around about an inch out from your belly button a high number of tap bridge don't tap like this tap like you're a sewing machine putting tiny stitches all around your belly button percussively not not pressing tapping percussive tapping around your belly button about four times five times you can't really overdo it really um, and then you'll have a dramatic mood if, if you've got this problem you'll have a dramatic mood change and it'll happen within a half an hour it usually happens within 15 minutes but within a half an hour it will be it's like the sun comes out colors come back into the world it's, it's a dramatic change now this is also as I said yesterday a relationship saver uh, I should let you know that if you have this part of the problem is you don't think of doing this for yourself so you almost need somebody to tell you to do it because it's part of the depression not wanting to do anything is like you know, I don't care everything's nothing's gonna get any better you know you need to have someone tell you to beat around your belly button remember one time uh, my son was a teenager which is tough anyway uh, he was really really cranky I said Alex come over here he says no I'm gonna stay pre post I said no not lift here you're not get over here so I tapped on his belly button about 10 minutes later, it comes back. I'm sorry, Dad. I was really cranky. I'm all, just a bag of wrenching hormones. I know, honey. But you can you can dramatically change someone's attitude this way. Uh, so keep in mind, it's going to happen during weather change with weather changes coming through, hard you know strong emotions, and the people who have it often don't think they do it for themselves. So it's helpful to have someone around to tell you to do it if you're acting like this. So tell your friends, your family. If I'm kind of down, I'm cranky, tell me to be around my belly button. And do this for your friends and family, too. It is a relationship saver. You can dramatically change not only your mood, but your relationship. If one of you is like this, it's hard to get anything done. Now, as I said, about 90% of the time, tapping on the belly button clockwise like this will do the job. Sometimes it won't. At that time, uh, so people that it's not working for, they need to come in here and maybe get some chakra therapy, or we do some, there's some auricular therapy, do some ear acupuncture, that in those rare cases, uh, will do the job for them. Now, this is not a cure for every time of depression. It's a cure for this type of problem, which is very common, especially right now with these, with these weather changes we're having and the storm fronts coming through. So if, can you see this? So if you would like to contact me, as I said, feel free to message me on uh, Facebook Messenger. If you'd like to call the office, you can call us at 563-386-9494. And be sure to check out the website. I've got lots of these self-help tips in the blog on my website. It's drhogg at drhogg.com. And again, if you like this, please let me know. Hit like. All right, thank you.